Good morning and thank you for joining us. Good to be here. Congratulations on your first conference as president of, uh, and CEO of AMIA. What are you most excited about and looking forward to this week? Well, I'm very excited about uh, meeting all the members and getting to know them. I know many of them uh, because of my work in the field of informatics, but uh, it's going to be a really good opportunity to get to know some of the younger uh, members. And also, uh, we have a large number of really excellent programs that are going to be occurring, so I'm excited about some of those uh, uh, initiatives. And we've got some light-breaking uh, sessions that I think are going to be very exciting. All right. Now, as president and CEO of AMIA, your focus is on expanding the membership. Where do you see the biggest growth opportunities? Well, I think the biggest growth opportunities is that AMIA is an organization that has a very rich uh, tradition and, and real foundation in the academic and research world. And I think we need to sustain that. I think that's really important. But at the same time, we need to expand ourselves, if you will, and uh, become more involved in working with those individuals that are on the front lines who are using informatics to actually uh, make a difference in healthcare. And so I think that the opportunity for AMIA as an organization is to really uh, help address the needs of the chief medical information officer, the chief nursing information officer, and all the other individuals that are taking the tools that have been developed by the, the traditional members of AMIA and really applying them to make healthcare better. How do you see applied clinical informatics changing healthcare? Well, I actually, the reason I took this job is because I really believe that this is the decade of informatics. I mean, I think that what we are uh, going to be experiencing over this coming decade is that as we move towards taking information and making it more electronic, that we're going to discover patterns of care that we didn't even know existed. And the individuals that are going to help uncover those issues are the informaticians. They are the individuals that take the data, massage it, figure out what's really going on, and come up with patterns. And then based on those patterns, we can then modify the way we deliver healthcare. Now, tell me about your new initiative, iHealth. We can all see it on the back cover of the conference book. Why is it important? iHealth is uh, part of that effort for AMIA to become more involved in operational informatics. Um, we have the annual symposium, which we're having here today. Uh, it's, uh, you know, obviously a really gr good program. It really meets the needs of the membership. But uh, as I talked with the board of directors, it, I suggested to them that we really needed to have a conference also that focused on those operational issues, those issues around how we're going to change healthcare. So, what we decided to do is we created iHealth, which is taking individual information, applying informatics so that we can create intelligence to drive innovation to improve healthcare. I to the sixth power. And so our conference is going to be focused on those six issues. And we're going to, it's going to be a very practical conference. It's going to be a conference that is designed to really have uh, the opportunity for individuals to learn about the field of informatics and then take home tools that they can apply the next morning when they go home to their healthcare system. Now, there's been a lot of talk in recent articles about data scientists. One article in the Harvard Business Review asked, is it the sexiest job of the 21st century? What do you think? Oh, I absolutely think it is. Uh, I think that, uh, you know, that's part of the reason I was su suggesting that uh, this is the decade of informatics. Um, I think that the field has come of age. I think that data is now becoming more ubiquitous and it's available in an electronic fashion so that we have the opportunity to really uh, figure out how we can make healthcare a lot better, a lot more efficient, a lot more effective. And I think informatics is at the very heart of that. And I, I love Tom Davenport's article in the Harvard Business Review about data scientists and this is the sexiest job of the 21st century. I, I agree with that. And I think that uh, it's going to be exciting for all the members to really engage in that kind of activity and really help make a difference in healthcare. Because at, at, at the end of the day, when you stop and think about it, the reason I went into medicine, the reason I get up every morning is to really make a difference in healthcare. Kevin Fickenshire, President and CEO of AMIA, thank you for your time. Thank you.